once they get uh, the scales in, I'm going to have you pull forward and you're going to feel like you're climbing a mountain. Don't gun it or you go right off the scale, okay? Gotcha. Well, I do have my that, card. Is that your name? That is my <laughs> name. You Can check. you say it? Can you pronounce it? I was going to say LeBlanc. LeBlanc. No, what, am I, what is it? Try again. LeBlanc. 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 We're overweight. We have some things to think about here and some options. What are we going to do about it? I'm not sure. When you're weighing your vehicle and your trailer there are a few things to consider mainly three in my particular case that I think is important number one the gross vehicle weight rating of your tow vehicle very important to know that and you can find that rating in the inside sticker of your door the second thing is going to be the weight of your trailer so my trailer is rated at a certain a pound of dry weight and cargo weight so what I'm saying with weight is the capacity your trailer is with all of the cargo that you carry whether it be your water everything you carry the third thing to consider is the tires that you have both on your vehicle and your trailer is very important to know what the weight rating is on on all of those tires so that's the, the three things I feel are most important. I currently drive a 2015 GMC Denali HD. It's a 2500 single axle truck. It's a short bed. So the gross vehicle weight rating GVWR for this truck is 10,000 pounds. And the GCWR is 20,000. 500 pounds. Now, the GAWR gross axle weight rating on my truck is 5200 in the front and 6200 in the rear. Now, we also have on our trailer, it's a Van Lee Volano 2018. It's a fifth wheel. The, the gross vehicle weight rating on it is 16,000, which is the maximum it can weigh with, with everything you carry, uh, water, everything you carry. Um, and then the, the gross axle weight rating on the front is 7,000, and the rear is 7,000 as well. Uh, so that's all the weights on our vehicles. First step was to weigh the truck with all of us in it without the trailer attached. The front right wheel weighed 2,500 pounds, the front left weighed 2,500 pounds, the rear right weighed 1,800 pounds, and the rear left weighed 1,700 pounds. The second step was to weigh the truck and the trailer hitched up together. After the weigh-in, our front axle on the truck didn't change at all. Still weighed 5,000 pounds total, 2,500 on each side. The rear changed to 3,900 pounds on the right side and 4,000 on the left side for a combined weight of 12,900 pounds. So the GC, the GVWR, is now 12,900 on the truck. On the trailer, on the rig, uh, the, the right front tire weighed 3,300 pounds, and the right rear weighed 2,900 pounds. And then the left side weighed 3,450, and the rear on the left side, 3,300 pounds. For a total weight of 17,300 pounds. So... To get the GCWR, which is the gross combined weight rating, you add those two figures together, 12,900 plus 17,300 pounds, and that gives us 25,850 pounds. So how did we do? 
on our truck, the gross axle wheel rating, we were good on the front axle, but on the rear axle, we were overweight by 1,700 pounds. On the gross vehicle weight rating, we were over on that category by 2,900, 2,900 pounds, quite a bit. And then on our rig, the, the gross axle wheel rate, uh, weight rating, we were good on both axles on the rig, so in check there. And then the gross vehicle weight rating on the rig was over by 1,300 pounds as well. So then that, that, that brings us to the gross combined weight, wheel, weight rating of the rig, over by 5,350 pounds. Four out of the seven categories we were overweight on, so that was enough to scare me. Well, we decided to go big. Trading out the old truck for the new truck. Swapping everything out. Got the hitch installed. Got the hitch installed. And about to leave and go pick Tracy up at Walmart. I am loving the new truck guys. It is a 2015 Chevy Silverado 3500 HD Dually. I put a BMW hitch uh, as well in it and it tows great. It solved all of our, our weight problems. Uh, everything is, is in check now. Um, so we're good to go. And um, safety was a big concern but as I said before this truck solved the problem so just a word of advice guys uh, best thing to do is uh, if you're unsure about your weight just get your rig weight the Scapees RV Club has a great smart weight system and that's what we used and weighed the rig twice once before the truck and once after and it just gave me a lot of information to be able to make the right decisions and the safe decisions so Thanks for watching guys. If you haven't already subscribed and if you like the video, hit the like button. So we'll see you next time. Peace out y'all.